authorities surround a local scrap metal yard after finding a suspicious package. Right now, crews are evaluating a package left at Franklin Iron and Metal, which is near First and Burlington in Dayton. Several roads in that area have been closed. Pam Elliott has been on this story, this breaking story, and Pam is joining us now live with another update. Well, Marsha, to give people uh, an idea of where we are, we're just east of downtown Dayton. We're at Brenner and First Street, where you can see now that the traffic is blocked between Brenner and Finley. And the reason being, the building behind the trees, that's what we're concentrating on. We understand that an old artillery shell was found in the yard there at Franklin Iron and Metal. The employees discovered what they said to be an old artillery shell. We're talking about 32 by 8 inches in diameter. They don't know if it contains explosives or it would go off, and so they're being very cautious. On Lombard, which is in the area where we are, uh, several people have been evacuated from their homes as a precaution. Other people are voluntarily being encouraged to leave the area. But again, the bomb squad still on the scene trying to determine if this is an explosive device. Uh, that we've got fire crews standing by. We have Dayton police responding as well. We understand that the artillery shell could have been here for a couple of days. This is where people drop off scrap metal and that kind of thing. And it might have been buried. But again, employees wanted to alert police to this. And again, the bomb squad on the scene trying to d determine if this is an explosive device. Of course, we will keep you posted. But if you're just going out to lunch, for instance, from downtown Dayton or whatever, please be advised not to come in this area of First Street. Reporting live, Pam Elliott, 2 News on your...